bud. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm, oh, roughing, I'm roughing this up. Why? Whoa, you're in a new uniform. Badass, man. That's chrome? Yeah. Mm. Oh, almost knocked that hood off. I'm going to have an handprint on me. <laughs> so, anyways, polyester primer. Squirt it on, super thick. Sand it back up on the floor. Like I was saying, there's like five or six gallons of primer on this car. And that means on the hoods and the doors and the fenders and whatever. And that's what we're working on today. Getting everything uh, sanded and then re-block sanded. We're gonna primer it, re-block sand it, primer it, and keep doing it over and over and over until it's perfect. Until small spots like this don't show up. See the light spot right there? That's, that's where it's, uh, you know, those are low spots. But these are where uh, the hood latches go, so it's not a big deal. Um, the primer will fill this in, and the yellow that you're looking at, we do the yellow underneath, the yellow primer, so that when you're sanding, block sanding these, if you find any uh, spots that you go through, you wanna stop. That way you don't go to bare metal, because you can just keep on sanding until you don't know where you're at. Like on this here, you see all the yellow, that's just primer, a different color. It's the same kind of primer, but a different color, just so when you're sanding through it, doesn't uh, you don't keep on going until you hit bare metal. And then this is glass smooth right now. It's all blocked out. He's doing an awesome job. Making it look pretty. He's like the perfectionist. Almost as pretty as me. Almost as pretty as you. Yeah. Oh, it just threw up in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> but it's getting there. Just busting ass. And then like uh, when you're block sanding, you see all these light spots right here. That would be a low spot. So, and, and it's so low that you can't fill it with your hand. But when we go to put some more primer on this, two or three more coats, uh, that'll fill up. And then when we block sand this again, this is gonna be a perfect trunk. So that, you know, when the car's painted and the paint's nice and juicy looking, and you buff this out, it, I mean, it's gonna be extremely beautiful. And then you can see underneath the doors, that's a, the yellow is the stuff I was talking about. You know, on the inside, you just got a primer sealer, everything, you don't have to do all the block sanding and whatever on the inside because that's something that doesn't, you, you know, you don't see it on the outside or whatever. But here to give you a shop update. So what else is new? What's going on? Oh, a little less sleep. Why Smashed sleep? my toe. <laughs> Why'd you do that, man? I don't know. Just figured my toe needed to be woke up. <laughs> like the hammers, I always call them a thumb finder. Yep. I always find my fingers. So, uh, we got this car to finish up, like I was saying last night on the other video. And as soon as we get this thing painted, and it's looking really good right now, as soon as we get this thing painted, uh, you know, the first thing we'll do is buff it out. We're gonna wet sand it, color color match it, or uh, color uh, sand it, and which is wet sanding, but making it where it's all block sanded real perfect. And then when there's no, uh, gloss on the clear coat then we'll buff the thing out all the way down to like you know 3,000 grit paper so by the time we're done done this thing's just the paint's gonna look like candy on here it's gonna just be juicy looking and uh got lucky mats blocks been using the hell out of those these things are amazing if you guys get a chance check out lucky mat uh lucky mats rod shop on youtube a badass um i got three more sets coming in the mail uh, He'll be building those this week, so that'll be cool. Lots of new stuff. I think this weekend we're gonna go Christmas shopping or something. Get the hell out of here. I don't even know where this car right now. Um, huh? I'm done Christmas shopping. You're done Christmas shopping? I haven't even started. I'm one of those guys that like goes Christmas shopping on like the 26th when, they're, when there's all the good deals. Yeah. Tell everybody Santa forgot. I hope I'm done Christmas shopping. I think I'm gonna just quit everything. I'm uh, burned out. <laughs> no more holidays. Yeah. Except for Thanksgiving, I like to eat. Yeah, I'm still stuffed from Thanksgiving, I think. So, all these panels right now, what we're doing is uh, we're just taking the glaze off with some sandpaper. So it's kind of just powders the top coat so that the sandpaper doesn't get all sticky. And then uh, we're gonna block everything and then we're gonna wet sand everything and then like I said, we're gonna put you know two or three or four more coats of that primer surface around here. It's a poly prime. It's a polyester primer, and then uh, 
and then we're gonna go back through and sand it some more. So you can see all these little dimples. It's kind of like orange peel in the primer, and that's what we're sanding out right now. So it gets nice and smooth, so that it looks like that. Nice and smooth, and then after we're done blocking it out, like I said, we'll wet sand it so it's crazy smooth, and then we'll put the, the other primer on it. Man, this heater's blowing right in my face. <clears throat> At least nice. it's warm in here. It's, nice. it's cold outside. Warm outside now. Hi, Kevin. <laughs> oh, my hands are dirty. What's up, Charlie? So, yep, big things happening though. Um, and like I was saying last night, uh, we're gonna be doing uh, some cool stuff pretty soon. So you guys stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Say goodbye. Bye. That's it, just generic yawn and bye. Are they bye. boring you? <laughs>